hey you guys what's up welcome back to my channel i have got no makeup on i got my deep deep morning voice but i'm gonna be doing a little full day of eating kind of day in the life vlog i am working today it's a weekday but i'm gonna be going into the office at one point so it'll be a little inch more interesting than just me sitting at home so let's go get the day started i'm gonna go make a whipped coffee so let's head downstairs good morning frankie good morning so good so good yeah, I'm sleepy too, huh? So I'm back, had a few hours of conference calls and I'm getting ready to head up to my office in South LA. I've got a new work laptop, if you can see that. So I've got to check that it works at my actual desk and then I'm gonna ship that back and just literally get out of the house. I've been so stir crazy because I work out of my room because I have roommates and it's just literally too much time in the same space because even the personal projects like the podcast, all my YouTube editing, my room is the only place to work on it and I sleep in there. So it's just, a, it's a lot of time in the same place. Kind of losing it a little bit, but doing well for the most part. So real quick, I've got a Mutant Mass Shake. So this is the Strawberry Banana Mass Gainer from Mutant. One scoop in there, which has been good because I am trying to gain, but to be honest, I have a hard time eating, especially when I get stressed. And then I also have this delicious chocolate muffin. So I'm probably gonna eat all this on my drive, it's gonna take me about 40, 45 minutes to get to the office. And yeah, I will keep you updated and I'll see you in the next clip. Hey guys, what up? I'm just at work, had a busy morning, got a bunch of stuff done, feeling very productive, which is great. So I'm gonna eat my lunch now, I'll show you that. And then I may head over to the park for a second. There is a really cute little park, a historic park by my office and I've got a conference call in an hour. So just to literally get out and clear my head, I kind of feel like I need it, so if I do that, I will bring you with me, but it may be closed. I'm not sure, it may be closed, so it might just be a walk to the gate and then a walk back. All right, here's what we've got for lunch today. So this is from Healthy Meals Kitchen, I'll show you guys, in Fountain Valley. So this is just chicken breast, some green beans, and some mashed sweet potatoes, and I really like this meal. I'll have to double check the macros. I think it's on their website. And then I found some caramels from Trader Joe's in the break room, so I'll probably eat those when I'm all done. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> so the, the actual park was closed. The gates were all locked. Forgot my sunglasses, ugh. So there is a little sculpture garden just like across the street from the park. So I'll show you guys that in a second, but I just needed to get out for a few minutes, get away from my desk, clear my head. I switch tasks so often during work. So I'm managing, I usually manage like 30 projects at a time. If I don't take breaks, my brain just shuts off. So. This is a good little break. It feels so, so good, honestly, to be out of my house. I've just been spending so much time at home. But today it was really, really nice. It's crazy, you know, in the past, I always hated having a long commute and driving all the way to LA to go to work. And now it's like, I'm grateful for the fact that I got to leave the house and, you know, drive 30, 40 minutes to get here. And, and the fact that I'm gonna have a drive home too. It's so weird how things can change like that. <laughs> finished dropping off my computer at FedEx and I'm gonna drive home. I got a scoop and a half of mutant iso surge and salted caramel in here. I have half of my muffin left from this morning so I'll probably eat those on the drive home and then once I wrap up my full work day probably go to the gym. All right just got home. Look who I've got here with me. <laughs> oh my gosh Frank he is such a little monster sometimes but he's the cutest the cutest little monster. Did you find that little dude? 
Did you go in my closet? All right. So we are gonna go, do, and I say we, it's just freaking me. I'm gonna go to UFC Costa Mesa, go train some hamstrings. Whoa, whoa, what is going on with my hair? I'm gonna go train booty and hamstrings. I'm gonna eat this little apple on my way there because I'm getting kind of hungry and I wanna make sure I've got like just some carbs or something in my system. I'm kind of low on calories for the day, so I'm hoping this workout will kind of kickstart my appetite and have just like a feast at dinner. And it's not ideal, but honestly, you guys, like I get so stressed out now being in my room 24 seven that I get so anxious, I lose my appetite. So if I can at least get 2000 calories in in a day, that's a win. I would love to be eating closer to like 3000 a day. I was doing that for most of quarantine or a good part of quarantine. And then I've just kind of hit a, hit a wall with my stress and just ability to like handle life, I guess. So I'm working on it, but I'm gonna eat this apple and go train. Okay, so I felt like I couldn't really film at the gym. You can't have bags in there anymore. So sort of feeling like this might be a boring vlog. So I'm down at the beach, came down to the beach here in Newport and I'm just gonna get takeout from this really good place. They do kind of healthy, kind of sort of like cheat meal um, type of plates where you can get like steak or chicken or whatever and like rice and salad. So I will show you guys all that and I will see you in the next clip. We are back from the beach and I'm gonna weigh all of this stuff out, but it looks really good. I'm actually gonna pop the acai bowl in the freezer and eat this later. I'm gonna weigh out my food, try to track everything, and then probably close the video out after I show you guys what my macros for the day were. So this is gonna be bomb, I'm excited. Yeah. Here we go now. Okay, so we have here about five ounces of the filet mignon, which this place in Newport is so good, you guys. Um, I added about eight ounces of the vermicelli noodles just to try to get my carbs in, and then some salad. So I'm gonna eat all this. I'm probably gonna add some of these little saucies they gave me and try to figure out what's what's in them and what to how to track them. But that's about it. I demolished that food, which I'm pretty happy about. I'm gonna show you guys my fitness pal results and I just kind of assumed that I'm gonna eat that whole acai bowl later, which are pretty calorie heavy, pretty carb heavy. So let me just pull up my fitness pal and show you where I'm at for the day. Not totally shocking if you're a bodybuilder competitor familiar with tracking, I'm a little low in protein, but let me show you guys. So I have everything in here that I ate for today. Can you hear Frankie snorting? Oh my God. Oh my God, okay, oh my God. Okay, then let's see. Nutrition, where did I end up at? So with the way I tracked it, it's about 362 carbs, 96 fat, 93 protein. So definitely, definitely not where I wanna be with my protein. So who knows, maybe I'll add in a protein shake, but I'm just kind of getting back, back into a rhythm, back on track after what feels like at least six to eight weeks where I haven't been 100% just in my off season. I've been so stressed, I've had a hard time eating. Um, it's definitely impacted how much muscle I'm putting on or honestly like losing, which sucks, but it's been a stressful time. I'm trying to get back on track. I'm really committed to doing better. So consistently tracking is the way to do that. And if you guys have ever tried to lose weight or attain a fitness goal, it is so important. So anyways, that's it for the video. I hope you guys liked it. This is a little different than what I've been doing lately. The next video might be a try on haul or something. Those have done really well. Actually, my la my video last week was the best one in terms of viewership that I've ever done. So thank you guys so much for the support. Please let me remind you, do not forget to like and subscribe if you wanna see more content from me. I spend a lot of time making these and it would be just a really simple way that you can support me and encourage me to continue making these videos. So thank you guys so much and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>